Thank you. Let's uh, get started. Ashfaq, first question. Uh, Jason, how's the ankle feeling and how does it feel to be back on the training pitch yesterday? えっと、チェスリン選手、えっと、足首の調子はどうですか？昨日は練習に復帰しましたが、どのような、えっと、調子でいますか？Yeah, so first of all, the ankle has healed up uh, pretty well, and it's 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 good to be back on the field with the boys. Um, being on, uh, getting some cross under under the boots. So, yeah, I'm I'm, I'm thankful and blessed for for being healed uh, within this short time. So, uh, I'm confident and and ready. Yeah. え、そう、あ、すみません。sorry。えっと、チェズミン選手、過去数年のま、なんか状態とか教えてください。えっと、南アフリカを去ってフランスラグビーをプレイした後、どのような感じで南アフリカのチームにえっと溶け込むことができまし
Yeah, Japan is definitely playing an exciting brand of rugby. Um, they're giving a, the ball a lot of a lot of air, and they want to stretch uh, your your defence structures. Um, it's definitely the the style that I love to play as well. But I think us as a team, we have our own structures, our plan that that we would want to implement um, each and every weekend, especially coming up this weekend. So yeah, they they love to give the ball air, but we just have to make sure that we can we can. Uh, Make sure that we cut down options at, at some stages um, to force them a bit into a bit into some structure. I think, yeah. えっと、日本のプレーはとても見ててエキサイティングで、パス回しがとてもよく、えっと、ボールを外に展開するような、えっと、ラグビーは、まあ、自分がとても好きなスタイルでもあります。まあ、でも、それに対して、えっと、南アフリカでは、えっと。まあ、我々が準備しているオプションで、えっと、日本はしっかりと,と、えっと、止めて戦おうと思っております。アシュバック。ハーシャル選手に質問です。ハーシャル選手のえっと怪我の具合はどうですか。えっとまたえっと日本はとても展開の早いラグビーをえっと好みますが、南アフリカとしてはえっとどのようにえっとプレーしますか。日本に合わせて早く展開するのか、自分のペースの維持してえっと試合を展開しますか。Um, yeah, so I, I healed up quite nicely.、Um, my hamstring's fine. I had training yesterday.、Um, feeling good, good for today's training. And yeah, J- Japan does play a, a fast brand of rugby.、Um, I think it's important for us not, not to lose our cool and just to, to keep sticking to, to what we do and what we do best and, and try to control it. And then and hopefully we can, can nullify their, their pace and then hopefully it will turn out a good day for us. えっと、足の状態は、えっと、とてもいいです。日本は確かに早く、えっと、展開の早いラグビーをしますが、とにかく自分のペースで、えっと、自分たちのペースで試合をコントロールしていければと思います。えっと、チェスリン選手、チェスリン選手が試合中に最も楽しいと感じることは何ですか、それはハイボールをキャッチしたとき、えっと、ステップオフステップあのキレキレのステップをするとき、トライをするとき、どのようなプレーが、えっと、一番楽しいと感じますか。Yeah, uh, yes, for me, I think definitely I love to have ball in general play and having one on one opportunities within the game and create as many opportunities, not for myself, but for, for players around me. But there's a lot of different Situations in the game where you have to be the best、um, in every ability that you, that, that you can, especially when it comes to high balls, defense,、um, running with ball in hand. So you have to make sure that your all around game is it's really up there and that y o u mentally and physically、uh, prepared for that. So, yeah, but I mean, I enjoy running with ball in hand, and whenever I do get opportunity, I'll, I'll make sure that I keep on having fun. It's all. 私はとにかくボールを手に持って、もうワンワンのような展開で、えっと、試合をすることが、えっと、好きです。まあ、チームのためにチャンスを作ることが自分の仕事であり、まあ、ハイボール、ディフェンス、ラン、すべてにおいて高いパフォーマンスを発揮することが、まあ、僕の仕事だと思っています。えっと、お二人に質問です、えっと、チームの中ではその2015年での、えっと、日本での敗北の試合についてえ話し合うことはありますか、yeah, so I think If you look at the current World Cup、um, 2019 back to 2015, the, the, the rugby has de- definitely、uh, go Gone a different way.、Um, it's not the same style of, style of rugby that's being played.、Uh, I think teams are very more technical、uh, currently than, than the previous, previous World Cup. But knowing that we, we had the loss against Japan in 2015,、um, it will, it, I wouldn't say it would always be stuck in your head, but we know that, it, that it's happened. But it's, it's, it's four years later, it's a new opportunity for us, and we just have to keep building week by week、um, against teams that we keep on playing. And currently, we're playing Japan in the quarter final now again. So we'll make sure that, that we. Really well prepared and just implement what the coaches want from us throughout the week and not have that what happened in 2015 at the back of our heads. 
今のワールドカップを見ると、すべてのチームはもうスタイルやえっとテクニえっとスタイルが変わり、テクニカルなえっと技術的なえっとチームになったと思います。2015年で負けたことはもう承知の上ですが、まあ今回は新しい挑戦としてまあ再戦をえっと楽しみにしています。大丈夫？今週末は日本のファンがとてもあの盛り上がるのことは予想されていますが、どのようにえっと準備していますか um, yeah, えっと、とてもまあタフでえっと準備することは難しいんではないかと感じます。特にまあコミュニケーションの面で、えっと、チーム内でのコミュニケーションで支障が出ないように、えっと、しっかりと対応していければと思います。Okay, we'll take some questions in Japanese. So, here's a question for、uh, Cheslin.、Uh, there's a very similar wing whose name is Fukuoka, which you faced in the previous Olympic. So, do you have any ideas of how you're going to play against him, or what is, what is your general impression about him? Yeah, he's a very good player. He's, he's got a lot of speed.、Um, he's, he's really powerful and explosive.、Um, I've played against him in the in Rio Olympics.、Um, I've watched him play there as well. So, yeah, as I said, he's a really good player, all around player. But I think what happens on Sunday, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be the, the team and the player that really wants it the most.、Um, and that's, that's the. I wouldn't say desperate, but that's willing to, to leave everything out on that field.、Um, and it's going、um, to be an exciting、uh, challenge, and、yeah, I definitely look forward to that. But I'm sure each and every teammate within, within the group that plays, plays the weekend、uh, will be up for the challenge. えっと、福岡選手はとてもいい選手で、とても素早く、えー、爆発的です。でも、オリンピックでも、えー、実際にその彼のプレーを見たんですが、まあ、良い選手だと、えー、私は理解しています。まあ、日曜はただ、えっとまあ、どよりどちらのチ,どのチームが勝つことにこだわるかによって、えー、試合結果が、えー、決まると思うので、えー、すごく楽しみです。どのチームも、えー、ワールドカップクォーターファイナルズに向けて仕上げてきているので、えーまあ、すごいタフな戦いになると思いますが、まあ、楽しみにしています。So, he's got a question for the two of you.、Uh, in September, when these guys faced Japan previously, does that match、uh, give you some kind of idea what Japan's going to look like, or do you think Japan's a completely different team to encounter? <laughs> Yeah, so playing them in September, the, the warm up match just be before the World Cup,、um, we knew there's a bit of pressure because of what happened back in 2015. But in saying that, we, we, we know we had a plan that we wanted to, to focus on throughout that week and just implement it on the field. And yeah, we, we got the victory、um, in that match. But if you look at Japan going through the pool stages、uh, through the World Cup, they, they've definitely. Definitely revolved and improved their game in different departments.、Um, I think, especially with line speed、um, in defense and a lot, a lot of attacking、uh, at the breakdown. So, yeah, they've, they've definitely worked on a few things. So, they're a much better team than what they would be in September. But, yeah, it will, <laughs> Sunday, will, Sunday will only tell what, what, will, what will happen. えっと、もう9月の試合ではまあ2015年のえ敗北があったのもあり、まあ、プレッシャーを感じていたが、まあ、しっかりその週に向けてえ決めていたプランを実行してまあ勝つことができました、まあ、しかしまあプール戦ではえディフェンス、オフェンスともにジャパンをしっかりえ準備をしてきていてえ成長を見せているので、まあ、日曜の試合に関してはまあ実際に試合をしてみないとわからないのか、まあ、それに関してすごく楽しみであります。
Yes, sir. So he has a question for Chesson. Uh, what is your impression for the Japanese wing Matsushima? And do you think you'll be able to beat him and to be the number one in the number of scoring tries in the World Cup? Yeah, so I think funny enough, I, I've played against Matsushima back in 2012 um, in the Curry Cup back in South Africa. Um, so I, I, I know what type of player he is and I know he loves to, loves to run with the ball and just have a lot of freedom. Um, yeah, as about scoring tries, it's, it's not about me, honestly. Um, but if there is opportunity to to cross to cross the the white line, I'll just make sure that I that I ca capitalize on that because uh, I know that there's been a lot of hard work, not just uh, for me going over the try, but especially like forward wise and other backline players for creating those opportunities for us as wingers to to just make sure that we dot the ball down and not not lose it. So yeah, it's it's gonna be a good challenge. 2012年のワールドカップ 